Hi, I'm Joe Lynch for Tech Digest. And I'm Anna for Shiny Shiny. Today we're looking at LG's Optimus 7 handset. We've got six of these to give away, and the purpose of this video is to give you a little look at Microsoft's new Windows Mobile 7 OS. Microsoft specify that any phone which uses their Windows 7 operating system has to hit certain hardware requirements. So that includes a five megapixel camera, and at least eight gigs of storage. Now LG have bumped that up, so they're actually giving you 16 gigs of storage, which is a hell of a load of music and video. Another minimum requirement of the Windows Mobile 7 OS is a touchscreen. LG's is 3.8 inches, running at WVGA resolution. It's, so the core feature of Windows 7 are these live tiles, which are fun because a, they just jiggle around like that, beautifully animated, but also because they push information to the front of the tile. So you don't even need to go into an app or into a widget to see what's happening inside it. So for example, um, you can see how much many mail you've got, you can see what messages you've got, you can even see when the next train you need to get is if you set up the widget correctly. One of the beautiful things as well is that it's all linked together into these hubs. There are six hubs, and this particular one is the People Hub. It's quite slickly designed, so you see it's got this really sort of horizontal, kind of quite easy to navigate little, little design UI like that. But um, what's particularly special with this one is that it links up, pulls together data about your contacts and friends from wherever you put it. So you get updates from Facebook, LinkedIn with recent text messages, LinkedIn with recent calls, so it's really interesting, really smart, and um, pretty special. So a big deal for gamers when it comes to a Windows Mobile 7 device is integration with the Xbox Live service. So if you've got an Xbox 360 console indoors hooked up to their online community, you'll also be able to link it in with Windows Mobile 7 phones. So with Windows Mobile 7 phones, you'll get Xbox Live integration. You'll be able to check your gamer score. You'll be able to improve your gamer score by playing gaming apps from the Marketplace App Store. You'll also be able to send messages to your contacts, as well as getting information on upcoming deals and features through the Xbox Live online community. So the next hub we're going to have a look at is the Pictures Hub. Now, just like the People Hub, this aggregates photo content from any place where you store your pictures. So be that on the phone's uh, hard drive, or maybe from your Facebook photo albums, you'll be able to look at all of your photos, wherever they're stored, in just the one place using Windows Mobile 7. You'll also be able to send them to your friends with just a single click of a share button. If you like watching video or listening to music while on the go, Microsoft have you covered there as well. They've integrated their popular Zune Media Player as an app on the phone. Now, Zune also has a media marketplace where you can buy MP3s and video content. One of the features we're most impressed with is the Zune Pass. Now, this offers for $8.99 a month unlimited streaming of the entire Zune catalog, which compares very favorably to other music streaming services such as Spotify. So there's a lot of functionality built into those widgets which are already on the home screen. But if you want to get a little bit more, check out the Marketplace, which is the Windows 7 app store, where you can pick up quite a number of interesting new things. There's quite a few on there already, and there are a lot more on the way. And then finally, anyone looking to do a bit of work on the go, you've also got another hub which takes in all of the Microsoft Office apps. So these Office apps include PowerPoint, Excel, and Word. You'll be able to edit any of these sort of file types on the go. So imagine you're on your way to work, you're running a little bit late on a deadline, you'll be able to do a little bit of extra touching up of, to a file on the tube and then have it ready when you arrive in the office. So that wraps up our brief look at Microsoft's new Windows Mobile 7 OS. We've got a lot of love for the handset and for the operating system. It's not only a lot of love, we've got a lot of them to give away too, six to be precise. So if you fancy your chances at picking up one of these little beauties, then log on to Shiny Shiny or Tech Digest on the URLs that are coming up and you could be one of our six lucky winners.